So it is not a matter of being with Srila Prabhupada or having his association through his personal form. But what really matters is to take his instructions to heart. There had been many devotees who had been very close to Srila Prabhupada, had a lot of his association, but they drifted away after Srila Prabhupada left. Even when Prabhupada was here, many devotees actually left in spite of getting so much of the association. On the other hand, I have seen like there are devotees, those who, although they did not have any physical association of Srila Prabhupada, they are so committed to Srila Prabhupada. They have such deep appreciation and love for Srila Prabhupada. So from that, we can see that association, it does not really depend upon the physical presence. What really matters is accepting his instructions, accepting his teachings, and molding one's lives according to those instructions. So, <clears throat> I know that feeling is there, that, oh, had I have come uh, one year earlier, I could have been with Srila Prabhupada, if I came 10 years earlier, if I came 20 years earlier, that craving is there to be with Srila Prabhupada. But for them, I will say, don't worry about that. Srila Prabhupada is always there. And if you follow his instructions, if you mold your lives according to his teachings, then he will manifest himself to you. And what really matters as ultimately going back to where he is and associate with him. That option is open to all. You practice the process, you will achieve your spiritual perfection and then you will go back to the spiritual sky and in the spiritual sky you will meet Srila Prabhupada and Srila Prabhupada will introduce you to Krishna. Prabhupada will engage you in the service of Sri Krishna. So don't worry about uh, those who did not get the association of Srila Prabhupada, physical association of Srila Prabhupada. They should not worry. Rather, they should consider that this separation, this inability to not to meet Prabhupada personality, personally, should, should be the impetus to inspire them to their spiritual life.